All right. Now, uh, what I've got here is uh, a milkshake. It's nice, too. Have I not always sit here? I don't want to go to the sit on that bloody throne. Oh, totally. Oh, absolutely. It's the last thing I want to do. Yeah. yeah but we're absolutely so we've got to find an a. I have to find who can be the Christ figure. Make sure it's Harry. Absolutely, for certain, there's no bloody paper of blood in them. <laughs> no, he's right. It's, it's because of the death of his mother, the death of his great 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 grandfather, yeah. and. The death of his mother, Stuart. Now it's spelled S T U R T S T E W A R T, and some other ways as well. Thing S T U R T, some other. S T U A R T. There's several ways of spelling it. Yes. But it's all in the Stuart line because one is French. Mm. That's where the throne of France is. Was Mary Queen of Scots. That's why you have the United Kingdom. Because uh, James the sixth became James the first, but in English the, the court language was French, right? Well, so his is, name was Jacques. The bottom line is that the red hair has to come from France. Hmm? The red hair has to come from us anyway. Of course. That's right. That's right. From the Noah thing. It's all from Noah. Shem. Shemite. Shem. Mm. Now those men were half angels, right? Mm. You know, in the, in the story of Adam and Eve, who did, um, what's his name, Marion? Cain. Yeah. Huh? Well, he married one of those giants, which is mm. Satan. Yeah. Because in those days, the men could produce offspring. And that's what Cain was of the devil, an angel. Who's an angel in the sky? Yeah. So, okay. Doesn't really matter. Point is, you're here. So, what part of the dream do you wake up and end? Well, this is the resurrection part. Um, well, it's describing Enoch. They've described it in Enoch, it's white and black and red. The original. Yeah. Excuse me. The wolves go forth right here. Alright, so what we did with Harry. I'll tell you a story first off, I think. Right up, important. Um, I was uh, in a place called uh, Reservoir and had a Novalock kitchen outlet and uh, people would come in off the street and you give them a chart, they fill out the measurements and then you sell them a kitchen and they get someone to install it or we arrange someone for them by giving them a phone number. It's supposed to be cheap by doing it. Anyhow, no one wanted that. So I wasn't doing any business at all. But what happened was this Muslim gentleman came in one day with his wife and seven kids. And uh, he wanted to have the most magnificent kitchen you could get. We'd end up with a mahogany. And uh, he needed someone to install it. I said, well, I can arrange someone for you. He said, no, I want you to install it. After I've been talking to him for a while. So I said, oh, all right. So I went and installed a kitchen for him. He was an Elvis priest from Libya. And he was friends with the father of the present president. I said, oh. He said, yes, uh, they are Elvists. They believe in Jesus as a higher ranking than the Quran uh, portrays it. They're closer to the Christian idea and, if you like, to the Hindu uh, reality. If that came first, right? <clears throat> so, um, Assad, is it Assad? Huh? Assad. Assad, yeah. Assad. Sal Ashir. Sal He's a young man that um, has taken over from the, uh, his father and um, he studied to be a, uh, a doctor, optometrist, 
to work on people's eyes. That's hardly uh, what Stalin would have done. It's hardly what Charles has done. He's learned to fly a fucking helicopter. So, the line of the Golightly Marshal, uh, which links back to the kings of Jerusalem through the Golightly line, and the descendant Henry uh, Golightly, of course, and uh, that line marries into the Marshals today, and the Marshal line is also uh, from my father back through the same line that comes down to Harry, not to William because it's cancelled by the line of Dracula via channels. So there can't be any blood in the Christ sitting on the throne. So all I've done is prove an Arius Christ. And I'm his father. Wait, what's the hard part about that? If you want that, you can have it. And I'll say nothing more. Fair deal. Who runs the world with righteousness with the Iranians and the Russians. And, of course, the American army back in the world. So what I did was calculate from the date. So I've got this computer here, and we'll do a few numbers. You want to know what the 111 number is? Okay. 15th of October at 12.02, uh, lunation 1111. The last quarter, 7.34, is October the 8th. This is the date I come back to Australia. 2012. The full moon, full moon is 3.18, the 30th of September, 2012. Now it starts to get interesting. The first quarter, 1942, 22nd of September, 2012. So what have we got there? That again? Hmm? What, what, date what, what happened on the 22nd of September 2012? 22nd of September? Hmm. Well, 2011 was when Dex came and your brother died last year, so a year ago. And Along with the number 1942 at the UTC time. But you go back to the last new moon, which is Lunation 1110, which is 210 on the 16th of September 2012. And whose little boy is that? Sixteenth of September. Yeah. Does that mean anything? Oh, well, it's Harry. <laughs> Fifty. Your, Fifty. your general direction. Fifty. Well, it's Harry. It's on Toronto. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Well, it's just his birthday is in England is, is the 15th, so it's the 16th year. It's all about Aussie time. Right? Yeah. Yeah. What time was he born? No. All right, so that's um, now when we go back in uh, I'm just find it. Oh, there, it is. there we go. Between Saturday the first of July nineteen sixty one that's Diana. That Diana, yeah. And Saturday the fifteenth of September, both Saturdays, both Sabbaths. Right. 1984. Now, the 1984 number, we do it in Hebrew, very significant. To be clear of sound, but usually of colour, to shine, to make a show, to boast, and this is to clamorously foolish or to rave. He's running around in a fucking nude. <laughs> Why? comes from the 1966 number, which I've already been there and done that, so don't worry about it, from 1984, Lucifer, the morning star. So all this Lady Diana thing has been, she, she was set up as a sacrifice right before she was born. She knew that when she, she put her foot on the stairs to uh, the abbey where she was married, St Paul's, and she said, I knew I was the lamb to the slaughter. Right. Okay, in days between those two dates, giving birth to Harry, giving birth to Christ, eight, four, seven, seven days, 12, 11 weeks, which is, go straight to the throat. 
23.209 years. First four letters, 2320, got it. He takes it on because I'm giving it to him. Yeah, and that's the prophecy. He's my son. I give it to him. I'm too old and tired proving it. Mm. He's fucking around. Yeah. He's got our hair, my hair. Mm. So this is, of course, is a, a letter to Harry. Right? Mm. But I'm going to address it to the soldiers mm. of the United States and Great Britain and Australia. Mm. So we'll do it. We can change the name. First off, we go to Australia. Threatened with New Zealand. We get put on that So the number is Godhead. So we then have to find the word Godhead, which I did, of course. And. Um, Let's go back to one page here. Okay. Charles I was born on November the 19th, 1600. Prince Harry was reborn on September the 19th, 1984. September the 15th. Yeah? September the 15th. Typo. September the 59th. A period of 38 383.8 years. So you got a window of a week there is still, because you can't go that long a number, right? Mm. But it can be important, it could be a five. Mm. The number in Greek dictionary is Pantelis from 3956 and 5056. So you should read that to see what it is. But it means fully ended, mm. entire, completion, or most wise. He is the rightful king. Because I said so. Mm. Well, you're the king of kings. Right. So, take over. Is the Union Jack the king of France, the king of Ireland, the king mm. of Wales, the king of everywhere except the little block in the middle? The Iron Man. Mm. Important. Far too frequently, she's wearing sand shoes. <laughs> she goes jogging out the door. 222 miles around at low tide. Okay, got to go back uphill a bit, see what we've got here. Okay, so we've got um, July 1961, September 1984, means Godhead. For as much then as we are offspring of God, we ought not to think that the Godhead is, Godhead is like unto gold, or silver, or stone, graven by art and man's device. And the times of this ignorance God winked at. But now commands all men everywhere to repent. We're not talking about Christianity. Mm. Because he hath appointed a day and the which he will judge the world in righteousness. And it gets to big capital letters. Well, big letters, not capital by that man in brackets, whom he hath ordained, semicolon, whereof, in brackets, he hath given assurance unto all, men in brackets, big letters now, in that he hath raised him from the dead. Charles. Who? Charles. Don't. Raised him from the dead. Exactly. And when they heard of the resurrection of the dead, some mocked and others said, We will hear again of this matter. And it goes to Galatians, I think it is, 2.13, first time I've ever read. Beware lest any man spoil you through philosophy and vain deceit after the tradition of men, after the rudiments of the world, and not after Christ. For him dwelleth all the fullness of the Godhead only. That's the Godhead word we're looking for. And ye are complete in him, which is the head of all principalities and power, in whom also ye are circumcised 
with a circumcision made without hands in putting off the body of the sins of the flesh by the circumcision of Christ. Buried with him in baptism, where also ye are risen with him through the faith of the operation of God, who has raised him from the dead. Charles I was born on November 19, 1600. Prince Harry was reborn on September 15, 1984, right in the heart of the whistle. Mm. 1984 Yeah. A period of 383.8 years, the number is uttermost. Pantelais. And that's where we go, we go over to this other Bible program, the uttermost. Um, and it is Hebrews 7.25. So you look at 7.25. Plunder, robbery, from 726. So now you get in the mind in what it's telling you, right? From 138, oh, here we go, pluck, pull. Various applications, catch away quickly, sort of by force, take by force, one, 30 minutes. To take oneself to prefer, choose some of the forms I borrow from cognate hello me, or ahi, which is otherwise obsolete of 142. To lift up. Now, what this is doing it goes on and on. So, how important the word it is. That one little tiny word means. Ooh. Right, so. Which is the description of what happened to Charles III. Don't you think? What? That's the description of what happened to Charles III. Absolutely. Wherefore, so he's tied to it. He, is, he cannot. Do anything other than do what he did on that date, and that did, even though it cost him his head. Mm. What a wonderful thing. To be reborn with Christ, because that's where he sees his government. Mm. That's right. A period of 383, okay. Wherefore he is able also to save them to the uttermost that come into God, unto God by him, seeing he ever liveth to make intercession for them. Catch this one. Wherefore. He is able also to save them to the uttermost that come unto God by him, seeing he ever liveth to make intercession for them. So that's something. You're going to give you everlasting life. We do is go for it. And that's what he has to be to be king of Israel. That's right. So we call upon all the British and Australians and so forth and threaten them with New Zealand. How about Fiji? We threaten them with Fiji. Oh, when they mark that up, yeah, no worries. We did not. Man, object. Who was it, must plan, was it? So we have the devil and the and uh, the angel meets us first up. The one that takes the age to you know, but when he gets down there the car breaks down and he wants money. money to get back. Amazing. Mm. Alright, so uh, name a small army anyway, you know. And I will convince them of it. So we'll give Australia the opportunity. Are you going to be that stupid? Are you going to allow these military monsters to carry them? They have already voted yes, because the emails are getting through. For the magnetic meeting. They're as interested in that as anyone else. Because it's free. It's going out there. So we turn into a funny story because I'm writing this knowing it's going to get stopped by that can't even say what the lucky ever show. Guess <laughs> what? 
tried to convince her once and for all. Mm -hmm. Did you get a response? Have you checked in there? Mm-hmm. One second. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Okay, our battery guy can be here in a moment. Well, when he gets there, we'll stop recording. Was that Luke? Yeah, yeah. Luke is his name. So that was just after. Yeah, do it with this one, then. It's got the screen capture going already. Oh, okay. Oh, what? Just do your own screen capture. Why hog mine? Right, babe. I hear a vehicle. I hear a vehicle too. Heavy vehicle. Heavier than usual. So we've proven up absolutely that Harry, through his genetics, is uh, the Christ figure that holds the throne of the uh, United Kingdom for God. No. So by virtue of his former life, he uh, inherits Israel and be with Christ as is Muhammad which came back with Muhammad. And then Putin will not spend it. It's come back as a Yep. Here we go. Is that Luke? No, that's Asia. <laughs> they got guns. Hello! First in. <laughs> No, 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 the battery's going to go dead. I, I backed the car in so that the guy could get out the, the service guy could get at it without having to be doing it in the dark. So I backed the car in for the first time. And it went dead overnight. Why? Well, <coughs> we're going to the synchronicity to back to camp. Uh, you got August the 30th in 1769, Cook Sites uh, Comet. He was a lieutenant. He was out of the loop. What? He was out of the loop with the uh, captain's club. And, uh, <laughs> he's going to do it, isn't he? Yeah. Well, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to kill it. I'm going to roll him. Oh, I'm right. talking to Harry. Okay. Hello, Harry. Harry Hungryhead. <laughs> I think he and I stopped washing our hair at the same time. <laughs> Did he say you stopped washing hair? Yeah, I tried it. Remember it said you? No, I didn't. Oh, here we go again. Another memory oh. test. All right. Yeah, I remember it all. Yes, yeah, he said that. Yeah, no, I told you that Prince Harry hadn't washed his hair for, at the time that I read it, two years, which is probably about two years ago. So, uh, yeah, he's... <laughs> My boy, no, no, because we said it, right? What's that? You must be following us. We said it. No, I huh? don't think so. A lot of people know the trick. Just become more. I like more my version. Oh, I know you do. <laughs> All right, have your version. Do you want the camera? No. Where was it? So if one reincarnates, as uh, we are talking, the promise given to Israel via Judah, via the Hindu, via the Great Pyramid, via measuring the earth, we'll pinpoint exactly 
at the moment that Christ has to be born. At this time, Yahweh has to come down and point it all out for them. The last thing I might do is sit on some bloody trains. What a load of crap that is. And there's going to be a new Jerusalem. It's very peaceful. They just expand out the same dimensions, measure them up, and you get a portion left between Israel and the city of stuff. Wow. Okay, battery uh, shuts down at, well, see, I'm, I'm measuring 135 here. So we do the stars, and we'll do that right now, just to show you how it Okay, yeah. Julian Day is 245671.64792. Universal time 3.33. Local sahedral time is 12.26.8. Well, Mary, don't. What? I got the, we can have our location right now, time right for here. Star directly overhead is six. So we have two numbers come out of that. I always use the calculator. But sometimes it will change right before you run. Right now. Since CRV, yeah, the we've got 20 hours minus 6 times 60 minus 45 plus 24, 819. So we have got 819. Infamy, shame, dishonor, disgrace. Unhonored, dishonored, despised, without honor, less honorable. Preferable degree. Okay, so 5092. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying this. This is what's written. It is written. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we've got 819. We'll do that in Hebrew. A fault. Guilt. Tennis. Mm -hmm. Which we not by the cherry eight seven turns, so that happens. A fault. So what your behaviour is comes to my knowledge and I put the numbers in this what comes up it. So you've been behaving wrong and making a bad impression. But it is humorous as hell. What do you think of the world then? And uh, I applaud you for it. And um, you're about to get even for your 
not at murder. Because you are the true king. <clears throat> of the throne of David. So there's king of kings and lord of lords. And you're the king, and I'm the king on that. You're the lord of it, and I'm the lord of it. Thereby the grace of God. 